going after him. Mate, we've got a disaster. Wildlife for days, yeah. Jason, Jason, Jason! Oh my god. <laughs> we all know Australia has kangaroos. We all know China has pandas. We all know the lions of Africa. But what about those animals that go under the radar? What about those animals that you wouldn't associate with that place? Animals so rare, only a handful of people see them. You may not know they are here, but they live among us. My name is Cookie, and this is Animal Anomalies UK. The Rednecked Wallaby. Back in September 2020, for the third instalment of the Animal Anomaly series, my girlfriend and I went in search of wild wallabies on a little island in the middle of a loch in Scotland. We scaled the island looking for the elusive marsupial before chasing one down and subsequently being rewarded for our efforts with this footage. We'd found an Australian animal 10,000 miles away from its home, living in the wild right here in the UK. That episode of this series has since won awards in a couple different film festivals and I couldn't be happier with it. Except something keeps nagging away at me. Now, the thing we find in that wallaby is that the population on that island are already well documented and known about. In fact, on the subject of wallabies in the UK, the two most popular destinations are the Isle of Man and this little island in Scotland. So, while finding them was amazing, a quick Google search will bring up Wikipedia and it will tell you about them. But, I want to find wild wallabies in England. I want to find the ones that no one is talking about. And I've heard the stories about little pockets of them living in this country, but I've never been able to track them down. That was until today. So then, just about before seven o'clock, I'm off to go meet Jacob and we're heading to a part of England to try and find some of these wallabies. Can we do it? Can we not? I don't know. Join us on this journey though, as we uh, attempt to prove that wallabies exist in numbers in England. Sound, let's go. Right, so we're out looking. It is proper foggy. Um, you can't really get much vision. I don't know, probably like 40 meters, which is, is all right, but it's not the easiest. So we're gonna have a little explore, see what we can see and uh, hopefully we find ourselves a wallaby. So with wallabies, if wallabies see us first, um, they'll generally hop off in a way where they slam their feet against the ground as like a warning um, to sort of be like, back off, you're getting a bit too close. So that's one of the ways we'll be able to tell if we're near one. There you go. What have you seen? Straight through that wallaby. Oh my God. Bro, get the lens out, get the lens out. <laughs> We've been here like two minutes, literally two minutes. There's a wallaby in the middle of this field. I can't. <laughs> At the minute, we've just got this silhouette. We should probably stay here while you get it sorted, bro. <laughs> that was wild, well that. He's just literally, he's got his head down. He's got his head down like feeding. I don't think you guys can see it. Just in the distance there, in the silhouette, is a wallaby. Just chilling. I think there might be a couple around here, which is obviously population in England, but straight away, there's two. Are they moving? Are those rabbits and the wallabies have gone off? I don't know. The they're talking about. Oh, they're hares, aren't they? Yeah, they're hares. They're hares. Was that what we saw? And they planted the wallaby by that tree as well. One Bro, there's so much there. going on. There's so much going on. There's hares. There's wallabies. This is crazy. Right, I'm leaving Jacob for a little second because uh, we need a tripod to be able to film these guys. We can't get good footage. They're on the other side of this field where it's really foggy. Like, we've seen two hares and a wallaby. And we're, uh, we need to get that footage, man. Like, we can see them, but we can't film it. This is the hard bit. So back to the car, get the tripod. <laughs> Literally straight away. Mate, we've got a disaster. I didn't bring a tripod and Jacob's not got his. Oh no. Oh, 
This is the mud deck. So we're looking for this wallaby. We just got really close. I didn't see it, but you heard it do its uh, big feet slap away from you. So we got close. Didn't see it. Big pounding jumps away. So we're getting there. We haven't got the footage yet. <laughs> we need it for the proof, but we're close, man, I swear. Ladies and gentlemen, what you're looking at is the fastest mammal in the UK. Here it goes. Those things can run up like 40 to 50 miles an hour. Absolutely rapid. Bro, we're seeing wildlife for days here. Muntjacs, hares, wallabies. Look at that, that's wallaby scat. Wallaby scat. footage of a red-necked wallaby living wild and free in England. An animal I've been tracking down ever since the first wallaby animal anomalies was released. And one that isn't mentioned anywhere on Wikipedia as being in the country. But now we have this footage of one, we need to try and find more to prove that this place has a population of them. Yeah, he's currently watching us right now, this wallaby. He's checking what we're up to. I can't believe it. We've got it. He's going, he's going, he's going. There's two, there's two. Chase, chase, chase! In there, man! God, he's literally on the other side of this bush. <laughs> this opening, there's two. He's on the other side, one here. The other one hasn't crossed. The other one, gone. I saw it clear as day in my eyes. I'm not sure if I've got it on my GoPro. Right, we're splitting up. See if we can get some footage. I'm going to chase this wallaby that ran this way. Jake is going to chase the wallaby that he was looking at a minute ago. Let's see if I can get some footage for you guys. Come on, we've seen two. That's a population. Oh, there he goes, there he goes. I don't know if you guys saw that, you might have seen it. He's running off, I'm going after him, boys. I'm going after him. I've got to get that footage. Yes, we've got another one. We found another one. Get in. <laughs> 